again and in this second part of the video we will discuss how to install TWRP the custom recovery in Motorola Moto E first generation as well as we will see how to root the Motorola Moto E by installing the Super Su version 2.0.2 and if you want to see how to unlock the boot roller you can go back to the my previous video and also the link in the description box and the previous video is how to unlock the boot loader of Motorola Moto E and we will discuss how to install custom ROM Sanjan Mode 12.1 which has the latest Android 5.1.1 and in and also the gaps Google apps so that you can enable your Google account in your Motorola Moto E so we will discuss in third part of the video but in this second part we will discuss how to install TWRP and how to root the Motorola Moto E so let's see now copy all the following contents in the micro SD card of the Motorola Moto E custom ROM, super su, gaps all the links are in the description box so here it is the custom ROM and here is the gaps which is google apps and here is the super su now also download the adb file and copy the recovery file which is downloaded and also paste in the adb folder now shift plus right click will enable you to open the command prompt and type adb a large amount of text will appear and it means that you are on the right track now type fast boot devices to see that if your device is connected or not now my device is listed here so my device is connected now time to install the recovery TWRP now copy the TWRP in the ADB folder is which is only 9 MB now type here fast boot flash recovery and name of your recovery my name of recovery is recovery so I will type fast boot flash recovery space recovery dot IMG now I'm renaming it and hitting enter as you can see that some codings are also appear in the mobile now TWRP has been flashed now volume down will volume down key will help you to scroll down and volume up will help you to selecting up now select recovery and it will boot in the TWRP recovery now here it is from team win now do not press anything right now I have ejected from PC don't press anything because there is a bug in some TWRP but there is no bug in my TWRP recovery now time to root the device by installing super su so just click on install here so just click install and select uh, from micro SD card you can select to, from outside storage and then select uh, internal storage or external storage and click on super su and here name is listed here and swipe to confirm flash now I will flash it it will take only few seconds and after that click on reboot system the system will reboot in few seconds or few minutes Uh, Android is upgrading means it has been rooted so there is some problem in the wallpaper my wallpaper is got half black now let's change the wallpaper and see this problem is fixed or not just holding down and change the wallpaper set the wallpaper yeah problem is fixed now let's check uh, that our device is rooted or not so here is the super su which has been installed here so tap it to open it and click on no thanks ok let's install root checker from google play store it is a free version just turn on my wi-fi and open the play store and search root checker root checker now click on it and install it and you will see that our device is rooted or not now click on accept and install it so after installation open it and click on agree ok 
now click on verify route now click on grant which is super user request so here it is a congratulation root access is properly installed in this device so now TWRP has been installed in my Motorola Moti and also I have rooted it so this video is ended up here and don't forget to subscribe this channel for more videos and also I will make a review video of Cyanogen Mode 12.1 but before that you will see third part of the video how to install Sanjan mode and also google apps in that video so i will catch you guys in my next one